Hey everyone, I'm doing a little uh, loop screencast right now, so uh, talk you through a session that I'm about to play. We have four drum loops loaded here, they're all on the first track, which I'm going to be using as a drum track. Uh, basically there's some loops, they're from the breakbeat samples uploaded onto GitHub at the moment. So uh, there's the little break DNB there, it's the same loop in this clip. And, uh, the lively roller and the rim step as the last one. Now what you'll see me doing is uh, changing this special clip so that I can actually interact with the foot pedal that I have here on the floor in front of me, and every time I press that, you'll see that it starts to uh, record and if starts I press to, uh, it again, then uh, stops recording. So that's actually how I'm going to be using it. Now, uh, I can either right-click and press the special button there, or what else I can do is press Shift on the APC here and move that clip around the place. So that's probably what I'll be doing. That's just a bit faster uh, than uh, trying to use a mouse. So, jam, sorry, I'm going to jam a little bit and uh, we'll take it from there.
so I can see there how a loops actually kind of works. Uh, jamming on it, just got a couple of loops there, threw in some distortion towards the end. So, uh, primarily a bit of fun there. It's not really a prepared session or something you'd really do on, set, on stage as such, but uh, you know, nice, nice workflow for playing with some ideas that you have in your head and uh, something to do. So. That's a loop session. I uh, hope you enjoy and uh, more videos to follow. Bye bye.